Hey guys, what's up? It's me. I'm back. Um, yeah, I'm kind of, I don't know, like, this is a bit of a random video. I, I've just got some stuff on my mind and I've just been on my Snapchat, like, just chatting to you guys and, you know, when you just feel like you need to, like, talk about things and obviously, like, just get, get them off your mind and stuff. And... Yeah, like, I don't know, for some reason I was just driven to, like, talk about things on here because I'm kind of thinking about it a lot. And, like, I don't know, like, some days I... <sighs> this is really hard for me to talk about. I don't know what it is, guys, but sometimes I feel like when I put a camera on in front of me, I turn into, like presenter Danny or try to be perfect for some reason I like put on this front and it's really annoying and recently it's been really driving me insane and I don't know like one of my goals this year guys was to like really focus on like YouTube and try and be more consistent and like work harder and like grow a bit of a following on there like nothing crazy but just like grow like some sort of following on there and it really hasn't happened and it hasn't happened because of me it, it, i have not been consistent i haven't worked hard enough i haven't been like posting enough oh my god just touch my glasses like i haven't been producing enough content or videos or anything like that and like Sometimes it's really hard because, like, I look at all my friends and I feel like they're so much, like, more far ahead on that channel, on YouTube. They're, they've got much more of a following and I feel like for them it's just so much easier for them to just be themselves. And I struggle, like, just showing my personality for some reason, like... I don't want to cry on camera because it's so cringe, but, like... I don't know why sometimes I struggle to be just who I am or show my personality and it's not that I want to hide myself at all like I actually want to be so open and I actually want to show myself like I honestly am such a, like I, I want to be a good person I just want to show myself I just want to show who I am and share my love and it's like, it kind of upsets me when I feel like I can't show who I really am on social media or stuff like that because I don't want people to think that I've got something to hide because I actually don't have anything to hide. Yes, there are some parts of my life that are quite private, like my relationship and stuff because my boyfriend doesn't really like being on camera and my family because those are just things that are really important to me. And... I don't know. I feel like I put this pressure on me that I have to be perfect. And I put this pressure that, like, I don't know, like, I don't know what it is. I think maybe it's because, like, at school I used to get bullied so much and, like, I never ever f would fit in anywhere. And... I just knew that I wasn't popular and I wasn't cool and no one liked me and I felt like I had to change because no one else was going to change so I had to change myself and so God, it's such a mess I don't even know if I'm going to post this video guys because this is quite embarrassing I just sat here like no makeup on crying like a loser but yeah, I just, I knew I had to change. I knew I had to be like a different person. And I guess all I wanted was to be like liked and accepted by society or people. And part of me hopes that I haven't created this like facade. So 
strive for perfection that doesn't exist where I can't even like show myself that's annoying like I don't want to be that person I just want to be myself and sometimes that's the hardest thing isn't it <laughs> just like being yourself I think the main reason why I'm doing this video guys is because I want you to know that I'm just like any, anyone else. I feel like sometimes there's so much pressure on you when you put yourself out there. I know I'm a strong person, like I believe in myself and I know I'm a strong person and I've got this far and I've achieved so many dreams this year and I'm really proud and I feel so much pressure right now because it's December and it's like I've had such an amazing year and I'm about to go to 2019 and I'm scared that I won't be able to top it I've got this horrible pressure that this year was so good like how will I beat it like how is next year gonna be better like what can I do do you see what I mean it's just kind of really hard pressure that okay well next year I've got to like grow at this much and I've got to do this and I've got to do that and I've got to focus on this and it's just overwhelming maybe I don't want anyone to feel like, oh, I don't want anyone to feel sorry for me and I don't want anyone to be like, oh, well, maybe you shouldn't be doing this, like, maybe this isn't for you, like, I love my job, I love what I do, I love it, but I care a lot and I care so much and I put my heart and soul into everything that I do, I always put a hundred percent and I think that's the main reason why I get so much in return, I hope, you know, that things, when you throw a lot out there, a lot more comes around. And I have to say, I'm so lucky for that. And if I'm honest, I feel like me and my friends, we're all like that. Like, we're very career driven, but we're not career driven, we're just like, well, yeah, let's just do that. Like, really hard working. And I feel so blessed to have those friends around me right now. And just like my boyfriend and my family, like and all the people who matter around me right now. But yeah, I think I wanna. One of my goals for two thousand and nineteen is just to show my real true self a bit more, which is scary. But I hope that that Danny is a Danny that you will like and you'll like to get to know yeah. I love you guys honestly thank you so much because I feel like I can't thank you enough for like this year and what it's been and everything that's happened and like all of the people that are there every single day like support me and I just can't believe it really. Like you've made this whole year like so amazing. And I'll never ever, ever stop doing what I love and I'll never stop being the person that I want to be. So, thank you. Thank you for listening. And if you're watching this, whether you're subscribed or not subscribed or whatever, like, it means so much to me that you're part of my family on Instagram or on Snapchat or on here and that you're following this journey and we're doing this journey together. And maybe we can make 2019 even better, right? do it <laughs> yeah love you guys